My name is Maria Gusta Villavicencio. I'm from Ecuador. I just graduated from my master's degree in international business and my dual degree in international, in international marketing. So um, one of my main goals was to get a job in the software industry. I tried to do my best in the past and I was applying for thousand jobs in a day, <laughs> I, a lot. And uh, I got some uh, interviews and meetings uh, few of them, uh, let's say from a hundred, maybe like four, three, and uh, yeah, things like that, but uh, nothing related with what I really want. After taking the program and the courses and after doing my resume with all the, with all the needs and everything that Coach Quan um, just- Defining your career goal, right? Yeah. So I also discovered what I really wanted to do because I was confused. I was like doing many things and, and I didn't really know what I wanted to do. I know it was like something in marketing, but I, I, I wasn't sure about it. And that, that was, I think, one of the biggest um, problems I had. When I finished the, the programs, I had my resume well done. A, I was applying for jobs like two per day, maybe like sometimes three. But for me, it was like very exciting to see like many recurring recruiters like just reaching out to me and saying like, oh, okay, you are looking for a CRM, like people from PMG, people from um, a TripAdvisor, a, many ones. So for me, it was like, whoa, like I didn't even have to go and spend my time and energy like just applying as many students does because I did that in the past so hard and it was like time time consuming and also my energy was like it was a time like I was like no I don't want it anymore so yeah so I think that was one of the most important things also I remember you know during that time module four right we've been back and forth because you know that you want to get into a marketing field But I shared my feedback that just to be a marketing is not enough. You have to be more specific. Uh-huh. And we nail, we, we have to sacrifice those things that not in high demand and, you know, be very specific and targeted. And finally, you, you have a new brand as a CRM specialist. And after you launch your new brand out there without applying so, for so many jobs, Crip advisor come to you. I think HubSpot come to you. Uh, PNG come to you, right? All those jobs come to you without applying for. Yeah, that's amazing. Yeah. Also for this job, um, uh-huh. they just like the recruiter just growed me and she told me we are uh, actually looking for a CRM specialist. It it took like after I finished the model, it took like around a month, I think, mm-hmm. a month, mm-hmm. because I was in these. Um, interviews it was good because the recruiter was fast after after my first meeting she was like okay I'm gonna uh, forward your application to the director after that she, uh, she was also like okay I'm gonna forward to the main director in Shanghai because this company is from China originally so I'm so glad also I am in an international company because uh, for me it's important to have like diversity and And, you know, like I'm a Latina and, and for me, it's something like I, I feel really um, myself with international people. <laughs> so, so, yeah. That's, you know, such a great fit. Yeah. Right. right. And uh, how about the salary negotiation part? Okay. So um, for that, it, um, the recruiter already told me that they were, like looking for someone for a lot of time and <laughs> they didn't find that person until they came to me. So um, they gave me the offer letter. And after that, I asked uh, Coach Juan, like, what shall I do? And we were just researching. And at the end, um, with the help of Coach Juan, I uh, talked to them by phone because I wanted to email them at the first because in that part, I was like a bit shy or... It's like, um, I think that it's like very hard to touch. I don't know how to say, like 
-hmm. very difficult, but it's something that you have to talk because it's normal in the job market. It's something you have to negotiate. So I talked to, to the recruiter and she gave me the salary I expected and it's a manager salary. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. Awesome. I think you, you have increased your salary by more than 10%, right? Yes. Yeah. 12, 13, 13%. Yeah. Awesome. You didn't leave that on the table. That's yeah. amazing. Yeah, it has been really a long path, I can say, but I am so grateful and I was looking so much for someone like with a mentorship like Coach Juan and I had just the right time in that November. I, I talked to someone, I think it was Chasman. Mm-hmm. Um, then I saw all the stories here, many su- successful people and yeah, I was like, yeah, I, I want to be one of them in the future. <laughs> and now you are, yeah. you are one of our success stories. Just trust in yourself, trust in the program and follow every single step because that is going to be like a strategic thing to, to build that to, and also like to land your job. I think uh, after building my uh, LinkedIn also first, my LinkedIn uh, optimizing my LinkedIn with coach Kwan, I also got like many um, emails from, from recruiters, but at that time I wasn't prepared enough because I didn't, um, do my, my resume and, and everything. But after that, I was like 100%, okay, I have this and I have my LinkedIn and the recruiters are here just asking for, you know, interviews. So even if I didn't want it in that time, they just came and I had to do it. You know, I had to practice. I have to be there. And yeah, that's why I'm telling you, like, even if you don't want, you're going to get many, many uh, recruiters just asking for you and your expertise and everything. And they want you as a professional. So yeah, you all are smart and you can do it. So yeah, I I, I really appreciate also the, the coaching from um, Juan because she was all the time with me. Like, it was like very nice sometimes. Sorry for that. But she was all the time like there supporting myself. So yeah. I try my best and you're amazing, Maria. Yeah. You're Thank really you. on top of your game. Yes. So definitely, you know, uh, I don't want students to just finish the resume and disappear, right? Yeah. Stay engaged with me. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out. That is the part of the training. Complete all seven modules. The first five modules start having interviews. Complete module six, complete module seven, and stay engaged with me. Report me how it's going. Yes, that's all I ask. Maria, thank you again for your time, for coming back to visiting our friends. This is your forever home, okay? You can come back anytime. Yeah, I know that. Thanks for everything, coach. And yeah, I really love you a lot. Thanks for everything.